wow, wow, I'm confused. Is this fashion? Why are we segregating my big toe? I look like a jellyfish. My bum looks long. Why does my bum look long? <laughs> Hello there beautiful bright people. I hope you are doing well. Welcome back to my channel I feel like it has been a hot minute since I've been sitting here We haven't been comfortable for a good while. You know your girl has been traveling to the US of A But I am back and today I know I know you guys have been missing me shopping I know listen I've missed shopping but some days you have to save coin, you know, people. I needed to take a little bit of a break, but it's fine. I, I, have you guys ever been in that position where you've really wanted to buy, but you're like, no, let me be wise. Let me, it's a Tuesday, let me be wise until Friday. One thing I've noticed when it comes to shopping online is that a lot of the stores make these recommendations based on what's trending, what's hot, style recommendations, new in, all these different categories. And I'm like, but wait, like, does this actually work for me? So today we're getting comfortable. I've got my cup of tea. We're about to do a shop on boohoo.com. I feel like it's been over a year since I shopped on the website and I wanted to see what they're gonna be recommending to me right about now. Spring, summer is coming. They've got some new launches and collections. I wanna see what they're gonna tell me I should be wearing. Okay, boohoo.com. I feel like the site looks a lot better than it used to look back in the day. Long weekend vibes, up to 60% off, sizzling styles. $1.99 next day delivery. It's not even free anymore. Oh my gosh, new in clothing is looking like rainbows. Well, is this the trends? Oh, okay, I'm in new in, but I'm not seeing all the rainbowy stuff. Oh, scoop bodies. Um, I really like it, but I'm just imagining me in it. <laughs> I wanna be cute. I wanna wear a swimsuit with a visor. Oh, they got it in black. Oh, black or white. It don't matter if you're black or white. But tell me why the motif is what looks like a, maybe a pensioner with ice cream on her eyes. I'm confused. Is this fashion? You know what, I'm gonna be honest with you. I'm done with cycling shorts. I'm done. Can we let fanginas stay in 2017? I'm done with camel toes. Let it go. Okay, what do they think I love now? No, I hate clear plastic heels. I hate them. Look at this Cinderella shoe. This is Cinderella, Cinderella, night and day it's Cinderella. But this is a budget Cinderella shoe. <laughs> I don't like these shoes. No, do not recommend these for me. Put it away, boohoo. What, what? You have it in a clear court. You have it in a clear court. Jessica clear court. Wow, wow. I don't like these. Boohoo, we think you're love. Yeah, you, you got me all wrong. I mean, I don't mind the off the shoulder wrap midi dress. Oh, but this orange. Oh, we can make this orange work. Boohoo, we can make this orange work. Oh, not in my size. Why are you not in my size? I'll try the pink. Ooh, they, look at this little Gucci rip off. Listen, what are your thoughts on rip-offs? Do you like them? Or are you like, no, that is so bad. Or are you like, listen, a girl's got to save some money. If she can't afford the Gucci, she'll get the 14 pound quilted one from Boohoo. Do you know what? Don't hate the player, hate the game. It's going into my bag. <gasps> oh. You see, this is really annoying, right? Basically, I thought I could see this really nice little cropped polo neck jumper right here this baby right here right but instead what you're showing me are jolie ribbed cycling shorts do we really need ribbed cycling shorts do we still need cycling shorts we're done we're done i'm not i'm not picking up beige cycling sh well maybe i am let's just put it in the basket put it in the basket we need the song put it in the basket <laughs> that Put it in my basket until the bank balance says no. <sighs> Rainbow cycling shorts. Maybe I need my camel to show up like David's Technicolor dream coat. Maybe the camel needs that. Ooh, but the plunging rainbow bodysuit is cute. I'm getting that. That's going in my closet. New tab. New when I create a new tab, it means I'm on a roll. Okay. Ooh. This section is giving me life, yay. Those are right up my street. You guys know I have a thing for leather trousers. This right here, 
these leather trousers. Oh, 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 please, let me look this good. And for £25, I, ooh, my subtotal, my sub, my subtotal. Hello darkness, my old friend. Oh, now it's showing me all of the Steph London stuff. This is nice though, this is really nice. This little sweat set, I love it. Oh, and it's 18, 18 pounds isn't bad. I'm putting those in my wardrobe before they sell out because I know good stuff sells out quickly. Wow, wow, I'm seeing internal organs at this point in time. But over a swimsuit, I get it. Ooh, yes, tonal, we like it. They really did Photoshop this crotch to oblivion. Sorry, it isn't realistic. And I'm telling you that my JJ would be eating this up alive like a three course meal. Okay, I've got 33 items in my bag at 556. Returns are free. So, you know what? I'm gonna buy the whole bag. We're gonna buy the whole bag. <laughs> you get a bag, you get a bag, you get a bag. <laughs> no, only I get a bag. Okay, so my order has been made. It is, what time is it? Ooh, it is. Friday, 21.43, 9.43, 20 minutes before the next day delivery ends. So hopefully I can receive my delivery tomorrow. We shall see, but yeah, stay tuned. Okay guys, so it is the next day and I'm gonna tell you, it's not even been a full 24 hours. I have received my goodies from Boohoo. That was literally 12 hours and then by 11.30, I had received my goodies. I am shook. Now let's see if Boohoo's recommendations to me are any good. Oh, oh, what I'm seeing is bright orangey, yellowy. I don't know, what shade do you call this? Zoom, this is very, this is cute. This is very trendy. It's the whole like Rihanna Fenty race driver, race car. Esque style. Let me see if I can find something to wear on the bottom. I initially saw these. Oh god, they're they're shiny. They're glowing in the dark. They look like clown pants. I initially saw these because you guys know I've got a thing for leather trousers. These were in the new in, and then Boohoo recommended this. Mm. I feel like I look like a DHL delivery driver, but fashion, fashion DHL. Is it a cute top? Definitely not with the pants. We are doing too much this is instagram on steroids it's doing too much right let uh, listen the trousers they are painted on and my bum looks long why does my bum look long <laughs> long extender back but i like i do like these i do like these i feel like the trousers are cute not with the top i would but i would have to be feeling really confident in myself to wear these down like in public but the only thing is, I definitely have got long back syndrome going on right now. And it's just, but I've not been squatting as much. So maybe that's the reason as to why. I like the kind of color blocking tone. This is nice, but everyday wear, it's just so unnecessary. And you can see my bra continually coming out. So is this clothing in 2018? I've got to say though, these are great. They are really holding down my muffin top. It's really snatching the muffin in. And this is very valuable. Trousers need to do this more. Snatch in the muffin, make me feel comfortable. And um, I look like I've got long back syndrome. So here we have the nemesis that I can't get away from and it's cycling shorts. I kept getting recommended cycling shorts in every outfit, literally every item I picked, there was a cycling short recommended. And then this, I saw this in the new in. Love, this is so me. I, I, sometimes you just have to be quiet because for some reason I actually do like the cycling shorts. I thought I was dissing so hard, but I actually like this. I don't know if it's really my style, but I don't think it looks bad. And I feel like this is a really nice casual look. I've got these little Reeboks or I could wear my Chanel's that I feel like these would look so nice on like a casual day. The sun's starting to come out and I like this. I love this color palette. Personally, I love stones and browns and neutrals and nudes, and this is coyote. I think that the cycling shorts are on the way out because these are 12 pounds, and actually I bought them for six pounds, and that's why they keep recommending them. I think they're just trying to get rid of the stock, really. So if you wanted to pick some up, I don't see why not. I thought it would be way more fangular, like fanning to the wind and everything, but it really isn't. Like, there is no camel. 
but even together it's look don't, don't look too close but even together it's not actually bad some of them are literally crotch grazing this is great i i like this this jumper is nice i like the fit i like the way it goes over the shoulder this is not nice material i'm just gonna put it out there this is not a nice material jumper but the color's gorgeous i never aspired it i never aspired it but we like it uh, so this little number was part of the new in that they had and they had all these metallic items i was like okay i quite like this i feel like this is like festival it's kind of fun i won't be wearing it with cycling shorts probably some back black jeans or some denim jeans or something like that but i feel like it'll be nice on holiday this is much nicer than i thought it would be it's 20 pounds it's like this metallic and i'm sure i bought something like metallic last year that i wore all the time that i absolutely loved so i feel like i love this this year as well so <laughs> after i picked up this what was recommended and i kept seeing on the website as new in was the whole rainbow thing and I bought this and the rainbow thing was following me. So I feel like they wanted me to pick up rainbow. I don't know if I'm not cool enough to understand why this is a trend. Maybe it's because of Takashi 6 9 with his like rainbow hair. We need rainbow clothing now. <laughs> Guys, <laughs> I, I love this. I love this. Why do I love this? I love this. What? Guys, why do I love this? Why do I love this? Tell me why I love this. This is not fashion. It's not fashion. But I, I am living for it. I love it. I feel happy in it. My daughter will go wild. My mommy. She rainbow. I don't know. It's not fashion, but it's cute. I'm not going to lie. The material is not great. I was, as I was putting this on, I was like, what material is this made of? There is no stretch in this. It's a little bit like tissue paper. I would wear this to a festival. I would come up in that bitch and I would be like, I've arrived. I have arrived. I've arrived. I think it's mad that I like this. This makes me feel like I'm gonna make someone's day when I wear it. Is that just me? No, on a genuine note, I think the top is cute. Probably like something black, something plain. We don't need to do this. This is doing the most. Hmm, interesting. This for me works for festival. Okay, next, this is one of the first things I picked out. This was in the new in. It was a bodysuit. It's cute. It's a 90 on it. I thought this was really nice. They had it in the white version as well because we're not gonna come up in here with my butthole on show. Um, another thing that was recommended to me and all over the website was these. These are from the Steph London um, collaboration with Boohoo. So Steph London is a UK rap artist. She's really good. She's growing and popular. And she's also got this collection with Boohoo. So these were recommended to me along with lots of other bits from the collection. So I'm going to pair the two of these. Well, wow. You see what I do? Number one, I love this body. It's a really cute body. It's really, really nice. It fits really well. And it's actually made of okay material. It's not the same as that rainbow material, but it fits nicely. And I feel like I like the design. I love the fit of these. The trousers I was thinking is something very interesting. Like, why are you see-through? Why are you drawn travoltering at the bottom? And just what what's, what's your purpose in life, trousers? Tell me the purpose in life. However, I think, one, my booty looks banging, right? Without showing all of my ass. Uh, bearing in mind that when I'm away, I actually sometimes feel quite unconfident and uncomfortable when I'm in a swimsuit. You wouldn't believe it, would you? You wouldn't believe it while I film these videos. But something like this is perfect. It's a perfect alternative to a sarong. Like, I look cute, you get a little taste of the cheeks, but not too much. And you know what? This John Travolta ladies night thing over here isn't bothering me. I think these are popping. So once I picked one thing from the Steph London collection, all recommended Steph London. So I picked up this dress, giving me that Versace vibe that I like, oh, it's, oh, it's that kind of thick. How do I explain this um, material? So this is this dress on and I was slightly worried about nips being to the wind. I'm not gonna lie, it's slightly open. It's more open than I normally go for. We're not all the way at the belly button, I'll give it that. 
The material is actually nice. I love the stripes in the pattern. I've become so gaudy, people. What's happened to me? I was a neutral girl and now I'm wearing stripes with like, I, what do we call this? Baroque design on top of it. Wow, it's really a lot. But what I loved was this like tie thing. The girl wants that waist snatch, you know, just tie, tie me in, suck me up. I can't be doing with this low V to my fanny. It's just doing too much. But that right here would be banging. Um, but I really like this, you know, for a little night out. So this was a good recommendation from Boohoo. I saw it, I clicked in an instant, I knew it was for me. Unfortunately, I don't like this. My hopes were so high, and on camera, it looks quite nice, but in person, it looks quite cheap. I don't like the sweat material. And then just, the it's boot cutting. I, I can't explain why are the sweat bottoms boot cutting, like, Explain to me why it kind of flares like a trumpet. I'm so, like, be a legging or be a, a jogger, but don't be a flare in a jogging material. I'm confused. And um, something about the Latisse, which is giving me Robin Hood, like space age Robin Hood. I don't know. I think the top, like by itself, is probably nice. And it's just the bottom of the trousers that are, are throwing me off. So if you wanted to get the top, get the top. The trousers, they're giving me flair. They're giving me boot cut flair. So I saw this dress. It's in my new favorite thing, rib. It was in the new in. And I think I was looking at all the like nudie stuff that they had on new in. And I saw this, I was like, this is right up my street. <laughs> Guys, I told you. Clavicle is cleavage, wrap is snatch, rib is life. This is everything you need in a dress, people. I love this. I love sweetheart neckline dresses like this. I love the way they look and even love the colour of this. I feel like they had this whole section that was like about nudes and stuff and I was like, okay, let me get into it. The dress is nice. This is £15. This is £15 and it's actually quite nice. My shoulders are going to be tan this summer because <laughs> they're going to be seeing so much light. I think this is really buff. I like it. It's even quite short but I can like pull it down and it isn't literally bum snatching these short. Like my bum looks nice in this, it looks cute. I love stuff like this because I feel like it really makes me feel really comfortable about my belly. I am the kind of person, yes I have insecurities, but I don't know the wrong with that, I don't care. This is a great illusion that brings in the waist. If you are straight up and down, get a wrap. This is a great dress, this is a great dress for 15 pounds. Unfortunately, recommended to me after this was this dress. It had a big label on it saying as seen on TV. What what they lied? Boohoo, you were lying. You did you were recommending this because you want to get it sold. It was like this dress was seen on TV. Is that a good thing? It literally looks like a jellyfish dress. But it was in my recommended. So boohoo, you thought I might like this? <laughs> This looks like an art and craft project. This is show and tell where mummy made me a dress because I want to be a jellyfish when I grow up. Why does the dress have tentacles? Why we have this tentacle skirt, I don't know. There's no reason for it. Why, who, who thought this was a good dress idea? If you have this dress, tell me you have this dress. I want to know, why did you buy this dress? If you bought this dress, why? Would you buy this dress and why would you buy it? This is just a lot of wasted material. This could have made a whole other dress. Boohoo, this wasn't a good recommendation. I look like a jellyfish. This is the one thing that I've got to say about some of these stores. Not all of them, but it's, you know when you open a package and you're like, oh, I want it to be nice and feel amazing. And then it's just this like, it's basically the same material as Primark. It isn't great. It's very cheap and fast, but it probably looks nice, but it doesn't feel nice, right? But this was one that was on new in, and I love the way the model looked. I was like obsessed with the model. I remember it's the model that I liked, and I love the way she wore this, and I like me in blue. I'm gonna try this on. Wow. This top is interesting because it's made in the way to be lopsided, which is quite nice. I feel like it looks nice on. It does look nice on. It looks nice on. It's flattering, it fits nicely. There's something about the material that I just don't like. I feel like I put this in the wash and it's over. That's a wrap. But 
as a fit and as a jumper, I think this looks banging on. No, am I wrong? It's 12 pounds and I feel like it looks nice like if you want to wear it once or twice i just don't think this is going to wash well i'll risk it i'll risk it this is a keeper i really like this so after i picked up this basically i got recommended a whole bunch of really nice tops so boohoo i'm down and i love blue at the moment which is crazy and then there's a bunch of other tees that were recommended so i'm just going to put these on and we're going to see if they look good okay so here's this one and i remember when i picked this up i was so annoyed because it's cropped and basically everything in this world is cropped. Why do we always have to be cropped? Can you not be cropped? But it's not a bad crop. Like, it's not an awful crop. Yes, it's not great with these jeans because we've just got a nice little sleeper gathering going on. It's 14 pounds. It's ribbed, it's nice, but the zip isn't good quality. What are these tops called, racer tops? Look, I have a thing for these and these are both from Topshop. So this is this vest, it says Chicago on it. I picked a size 10, I feel like I should have picked a size 8, I really like it. I love the fact that it's not like really really low all the way down to here. More top should be this, um, this kind of shape, it's just a bit more easier as a girl with boobs, like you don't always want like boobs, and I don't have a big boobs, the, the, my boobs are fake, yes they are, but they're not huge, but like you know girls with really big busts, they must be struggling because everything is literally here's a meal, here's my village feeders, all the time, it's just tiring, like we're not hungry right now, but this is nice, it's like, you know, put it away, we'll have meal times later. I cannot wait to do a bunch of summer videos, people. How cool is this though? This was recommended, it's a tea, but with some sauce. I like that, it's got this little thing here, which I don't really entirely know, you know, if it's suitable, like, do we just do we just let it hang? Let it hang like a depressed penis? What do we do about it? It's just kind of there living its sad life. But this was £15. I actually think it's worth it. I think it's worth it. It's not expensive. I like it. It's a bit of a different tea. And again, as I said, it's got the elastic in it, which I think is really nice. This was recommended straight after this one. I remember this. What do you guys think? I like the cut. The colour isn't nice. I feel like this colour would look nice on someone else, but on me I feel like it looks quite dowdy. Am, am I wrong? It just, no, it looks a bit depressive on me. Maybe it's because I've got my dark lip on. It just doesn't look nice on me as a colour. But the fit of the jumper's nice. I like the drop sleeve again. Meh, nice. I love that Boohoo also recommended to me accessories, people. Accessories. This is nicer than I thought it was gonna be. Listen, it's not everyday Gucci. Some days is boohoo. Because you know there's obviously the bum bags that are Gucci that everyone's wearing. But like, you know, we can't all do that every day. And I do have a thing about when brands copy like designers and stuff, but meh, Zara's been doing that from day dot, so whatever. This I actually think is very nice. I didn't expect it to be this nice. I did not expect it to be this nice. This is buff. Oh, this is so nice. <laughs> this is so nice. I'm, I, I'm annoyed at how nice this is. I did not expect this bum bag to be this cute. And the material's nice. I mean, obviously it's not real leather or anything like that, but some of us don't even wear real leather anyway. But look at that. No. I think that was 18 pounds. I'm not gonna lie, I was unfortunately disappointed by this recommendation or well, either i saw this on new in or boohoo recommended it to me and i picked it up you know cow print we've got rainbow we've got cow by the way they had a cow print denim suit a whole suit including the skirt that is doing tmi too much but we're gonna try the jacket fashion the fact that they had a two-piece suit in cow print. Wow. They had a two-piece suit in cow print. I don't actually hate it. This is not going to be me on a Tuesday afternoon. But I don't hate it. How am I going to like it? I just wish it was shorter. It should have been here. I thought I would think this was ridiculous. And I was wondering why Boohoo would recommend this to me. But I get it. Like, if you're a fan of, like, black and white with a bit of extra on top, then you can roll with this. I think Boohoo was going for a thing of recommending crazy jackets. This was another one. Um, we have ice cream cone for eyes. What What's going on in fashion nowadays? Just somebody tell me. 
somebody tell me it's crying oh i thought i thought the ice cream cone eyes are crying but it's actually the ears that are leaking <laughs> on the front i love everything about this i like the length of it it's like a little oversized denim shirt really okay sometimes the recommendations i really like this is so me this is how i do like my casual like ripped up edges um like button down oversized and then the back is just a bit cheeky and fun but i bloody love this i feel like the tassels are doing the most but i could rip the tassels off why do i like this i don't i shouldn't like this boohoo but i do finally we're gonna go into some footwear i think i must have been looking at the nude and this is why this was recommended to me oh lord <laughs> This is giving me toe part if there ever was a toe part. Why are we segregating my big toe? My toes are big and long enough. Why is there a separate section for it? I don't understand. And then when I clicked on the shoe and put it in my basket, this dress was recommended to me. This might be like wedding season appropriate. Actually, this color is kind of nice. And actually together, to do a scream sorry i got so excited this dress is nice i was thinking that it was about to look so grandma so doris it was about to be a doris dress we love doris we love doris by the way i'm not ageist or anything but you know i don't want to be looking like doris <laughs> not yet but i feel like this is a gorgeous dress that is really nice for wedding season the material is actually quite nice and my bum looks like a bullet in a good way and Giving waist cov- they're giving me waist coverage. Don't give me waist coverage because it means I'll continue eating. Yes! At the wedding I can eat all the wedding cake in the world and just, just put this in, just put this there, you know? I'm shocked that how nice this is. Because when I saw this in my recommended, I was not impressed. I was not impressed. So we went from toe pop shoe to this. But for some reason I feel, I feel like it could work. I feel like it could work. I feel like you can wear it off the shoulder is get that clavicle out listen get yourself this dress go to the wedding and get yourself your own husband i've got a wedding that's happening in france and i'm i'm about to wear my dress this is the dress i'm wearing to this wedding are you crazy this is look at my booty no squats you know no squats i feel like the best was saved to last i'm very impressed with this and my toe part shoes I don't hate them. They're not comfortable though. Now, never in my life would I pick up these shoes. These were recommended to me by Boohoo. They are not comfortable. My toes are hanging on the outside, trying to cling on for dear life. However, overall, I've got to say, I think this was a great recommendation, Boohoo. And this dress is 20 pounds. Okay, lovely people, that is me done. That is me trying out new in and the stuff that Boohoo have recommended to me. And I've got to be honest with you, I think they killed it. There were some duds, just a, f just a very few duds. And obviously, I, I didn't pick up everything they recommended to me. I'm not picking up clear Cinderella shoes, like, no. But some of the stuff that they recommended, I was like, I wouldn't normally pick this. I don't really like this. When I put it on, I was like, wow, it was really nice shock horror darlings shock horror and um i mean with the material on boohoo it is hit or miss it's an affordable website it's quick fast fashion just so you know like you kind of know what you're getting you want to go out on friday night and you don't have an outfit go on boohoo you'll find something delivery 199 but it came within 14 hours i don't know what to say i kind of like it i like it they made some great decisions to me i'm happy okay guys i think that is it from me as i mentioned i'll be doing a little bit of a giveaway throughout may so i want you to give this video a thumbs up leave a comment about something in this video also make sure you follow me on my instagram and on my twitter and staying really active and leaving me comments and i will be picking winners i have done this regularly in the past so i want to do it even more regularly just to give back to you guys and just to let you know that i really care and i appreciate you all okay i will have everything everything good and bad and ugly linked in the description box buy a few pieces if you want to see what boohoo recommend to you 
maybe maybe you could trust it a little bit they might push you out just a touch we'll see okay guys thank you for watching bye